Guys, welcome to another episode of Two Pit Bulls, where I do dog education videos. Today, I'd like to jump right into the topic, and so today's topic is what is a Jack Russell. This is a fan requested uh, breed topic, so I'll be doing this one really quick. Um, so, if any dog can top the high energy level of a fox terrier, it is a Jack Russell. If any dog can top the hard, you know, the hard as nails working ability of a boar terrier, it is Jack Russell. And if any dog can top the strong prey drive, bold tenacity determination and intensity of a jack russell terrier well that could only be another jack russell <laughs> so um this bright clever athletic breed is you know it's on top of everything that's going on in its environment nothing gets by him a solitary or a sedate lifestyle is not suited for a jack to a jack russell he requires full participation in the family and vigorous daily play sessions especially ball chasing which he tends to be passionate about, even obsessive. Too little exercise, too little companionship, and too little mental stimulation will quickly lead to boredom, which will return lead to destructive behavior. JRTs are not apartment dogs. So Jack Russell Terriers are not good apartment dogs. They need to be running out in the field, you know. Um, and yeah, she's freaking out because of the camera. Look at her. She's like, man, get that camera away from me. Look at him, he's like, man, I don't care if you're recording me, recording me, all I care about is just chilling and these flies keep getting on me. Another thing about the flies, if your dogs are outside dogs like mine, and uh, outdoor dogs like mine, and uh, you know, flies are getting on them, you can just use a spray, there's a spray that you can use that'll keep the flies off. I'll probably be spraying a little bit more of it on their coat, and uh, yeah. Most Jack Russell Terriers are happy, uh, go lucky and friendly with strangers, but in the presence of strange dogs, keep them close and under control. If the other dog minds uh, its own manners, the Jack Russell will usually adhere to, you know, a live and let live philosophy. But some Jack Russells are so brash and fearless they will take on a Rottweiler if it looks cross-eyed at them. So you gotta watch out, you know, some Jack Russells, they're not to be messed with, you know, these aren't, just cause they're little dogs, you know, doesn't mean they, you should underestimate them. Um, two Jack Russell Terriers should never be left alone together. All may appear to go well for a while, even a long while, but with this breed, a seemingly amiable relationship can suddenly flare into daily combat over something as unconscious as a possession of a chewy toy. If you keep two Jack Russells, it is safest to separate them when you leave the house. I'm sorry guys about the background noise. Um, some of my family members are working on cutting a car chassis, so sorry about that. Can't do anything about it, but uh, just bear with me and uh, I'll keep bringing you guys the videos. So moving on, <clears throat> if you want a dog who is conveniently sized, natural looking and sturdy, is one of the most energetic, athletic, determined and intense of all breeds, is extremely alert and makes a keen watchdog, yet is still sociable with strangers when handled properly, it is the brightest and most trainable of all terriers, loves learning tricks and excels in competitive activities such as agility and fly ball, a Parson Jack Russell Terrier may be right for you. Um, that's just the reality of it, you know. Um, Jack Russells are really cool dogs. They're very active dogs, um, especially since they're very uh, swift and have high agility. Um, you know, if you don't want to deal with a dynamic terrier temperament, providing plenty of exercise and interesting things to do, rowdiness and destructiveness of dogs, uh, very strong chasing instincts, digging holes, barking, constant shedding, lots of white hairs everywhere. Mouthiness, chewing on dogs, carrying things around, mounting your hands in play, potential aggression towards other animals. A Jack Russell Terrier may not be right for you then. <clears throat> Some more traits and characteristics of Jack Russell Terriers include the dynamic terrier temperament. Most terriers breeds are remarkably similar. The same words are used over and over. Quick to bark, quick to chase, lively, bossy, feisty, scrappy, uh, clever, independent, stubborn, persistent, impulsive, and intense. Terriers cannot be trusted off leash. They are too likely to take off, oblivious to your frantic shouts after anything that runs. Um, so basically, when you're walking a Jack Russell Terrier, if it sees like a small squirrel or a cat or something, it more likely will just take off and chase it. So uh, just keep that in mind. I'm pretty sure a lot of Jack Russell Terrier owners out there have, you know, gotten around this and gained proper training and uh, can control Jack Russell Terriers fairly well. Another thing, providing enough exercise and mental stimulation, Jack Russell, 
um, terriers are incredibly active go-getters. They must have regular opportunities to vent their energy and do interesting things. These dogs are so intelligent and capable that I hate to see them chosen by owners who just want a dog to hang around the house and yard. Um, another thing, animal aggression. Many Jack Russell Terriers are dominant or aggressive towards other dogs. Two Jack, two Jack Russells should not be left alone and one may kill the other over possession of a toy. Most Jack Russells also have incredibly strong instincts to chase and see small fleeing creatures. Fence security. Um, many Jack Russells are clever escape artists who will go over or under fences in search of adventure. You may need higher fences than you might imagine from their small size. They can climb a chain link. They can also you may also need to sink wire into the ground along the fence line to thwart digging gates should have the high uh, quality locks as some of these dogs can open flimsy latches. Barking terriers are often too quick to sound the alarm at everything new sight, new sound. Um, you have to be quickly, uh, equally quick to stop them to make matters worse. Some terriers have high pitched barks that can set your teeth on edge. Mine of their own, though much more amenable to training than other terriers, Jack Russells must be taught at an early age that they are not the rulers of the world. The toughness that makes them suited to killing vermin can, uh, you know, <clears throat> frustrate you when you try to teach them anything. Another thing, constant shedding. Jack Russell terriers shed only once a year for about 36 days, uh, 365 days, sorry. The short-haired coat sheds more than the broken rough coat. Um, so make sure you're really prepared for this. Many Jack Russell Terriers are put up for adoption once their owner discovers just how much these dogs can shed, which is pretty sad, you know. You should always do research on a dog before you're going to buy it. Now, and lastly, finding a healthy one and keeping him healthy. Jack Russell Terriers can suffer from eye diseases such as lens, luxatia, uh, luxation, and cataracts, joint diseases such as Luxating patella and uh, leg calf purchase perthes, heart disease, epilepsy, and more. To avoid these problems, you need to buy your Jack Russell from a person who can pass the 14 family companion guidelines that are listed on the link I posted on you below. So always keep that in mind. Jack Russells are really nice dogs, actually. Um, I think they were in a movie. I think maybe Wishbone. Wishbone? I can't remember. They were in one of those movies, though. So uh, look at her, she's Nala. Nala, who's your good girl? Give me two kisses. Look at her, look at her toe, look at her toe. She gets excited. Anyways, um, this is Two Pitbulls signing out. Hope you guys enjoyed this video on the Jack Russell Terrier. It was really re widely requested. Hope you guys enjoy. Until then, God bless and peace. I'll be doing two other videos today to make up for one of my videos the other day and then from yesterday. So I'll see you guys on the next one.